We are here because they're just about to launch a rocket carrying a record number of satellites into space. That's 104 satellites on a single mission. Seven, six, As usual, the PSMB. There it goes. In fact, this mission carrying only three Indian satellites. Most of the load here is nano satellites from other nations, including 96 from the United States. The previous record holder, a Russian mission which put 37 satellites into orbit just a few years ago. Let's go live to Delhi now. The BBC Sanjay Machanda has been watching the launch. Sanjay, this is a big moment for India. Uh, absolutely, Mike. As you know, uh, India has had a very successful space program. Uh, it's really created a reputation for being a, a very reliable space launcher, uh, but a low-cost alternative to existing international players. Uh, and I was speaking to people yesterday, people who uh, follow sort of space science very closely, and, and they were trying to explain to me why this launch was so significant. It's not just the fact that it, it's so many uh, satellites up on one rocket. But the fact that it's so complex, you have to ensure that even though these are very small satellites, uh, that they don't collide while they're being launched. Uh, uh, it's a very, very complex procedure, uh, and that's why it, you know everyone associated with the launch, the scientists, uh, have been so anxious about it. Yes, I know India has been pressing ahead. This whole business of putting commercial satellites into space for a fee has been growing, hasn't it? China and Japan also outlining bold space plans. Yes, that's right. Um, you know, many people are saying that if it was the Russians and the Americans in the 60s, well, now it's uh, the Indians and the Chinese, really, who are the new sort of space rivals, if you will. Uh, if you remember, in 2013, India sent uh, a satellite to Mars at, at a fraction of the cost of a similar satellite that was sent uh, by the United States, by NASA. Uh, I think it was a tenth of the cost. And there was a joke that, uh, you know, the, the movie, the Hollywood movie, Gravity, cost four times more than the, than the Indian satellite launch. Uh, and it really underlines how, how strongly India's sort of approached this whole lucrative commercial market, uh, you know, basically uh, allowing, allowing countries to take advantage of its technology, but also the fact that it's being offered at a very, very competitive price. Well, Joe, thank you very much for that. Those pictures on your screen now, live from the Sri Harikota Space Center in the southern Indian state of Andhra Pradesh. They've just launched a rocket carrying a record number of satellites into space, 104 satellites on a single mission. This is BBC News, broadcasting to our viewers in North America and around the globe.